total after the Houston game? Uh, I think after the Houston game, it was probably about 48. So uh, uh, exciting games like that, you know, uh, Coach Rick gives us, gives us the time to, you know, enjoy it. Uh, but you still have to understand it's, it's another week coming up. So uh, as a team, you know, we, we took that win. We celebrated. We had our time. And, uh, we're on Army. I pay zero attention to it. Um, like I said, Auburn week, I mean, every, everything's played on that field. I mean, um, uh, the, the rankings to the to the polls, and I, I mean, it, it means absolutely nothing to me. Uh, as a quarterback, if I don't go out there and do my job every game, it, it won't matter the result at all. Uh, it's a loss. So uh, as a quarterback for this team, I feel like me doing my job to the best of the ability, uh, ignoring stuff like that and just getting, getting this team a win, that's my job, and that's what I, I, I plan to do. Oh, we have light years ahead of us. Uh, uh, you know, with some people don't understand it, this is still a, a brand new offense. Uh, it's a brand new coaching staff for the most part. Uh, a lot of new players and a lot, a lot of young players. Um, this team offensively has a chance to be really good once we once we zero in and start focusing on the stuff we need to focus on. Uh, but like I said, I mean, we're, we're growing. I mean, uh, we're 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 not in bad shape right now, but we we always want to improve. So that's that's our biggest mindset right now. For every week, it's just to improve each 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 week on offense. Do you think that bye week was beneficial to you guys all feel well rested and anybody who's tired out there back Oh yeah, I, I feel like any bye week is beneficial for any team. Uh, when you can take time to look at what you've done as an offense and what you can correct on, and also take time to look at your opponent and uh, game plan. So you kind of get the best of both worlds with bye week, and uh, we've certainly utilized that to the best of our ability. So any, any concerns about the 16 days between the games? Or? <laughs> nah, not for me, just more rest. I mean, uh, more rest and more film. Like I said, uh, it's almost kind of like going into the first game of the season. You know, uh, that fall camp, those last two weeks, you kind of start preparing for that for that uh, first game. Uh, kind of the same mindset for me going in here. You know, um, I, I probably watch film on Army, I would say, at least an hour a day so far. Uh, and that was just, that, that was, like I said, that was during the time that we were going over uh, fixing what we need to fix on offense uh, on two lane side of the ball. Now uh, I feel like I had a good jump start on Army going into this week coming in, so I feel pretty good. You guys obviously going, going out every drive trying to score, but in a matchup like this, how much do you look at it as you might have a single digit amount of possessions in this game, but you got to take advantage of whatever you want? Uh, I would say you have to take the best. <laughs> The best chance of the, uh, of the opportunity they, they'll give us. Um, our defense is going to play their butt off. You know, our, the, the defense is going to get us stops. Uh, we're going to have a chance to make plays, and you know, we have to do it. Uh, they're 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 a milk it kind of team. They're going to chew the clock up a little bit. We're, we're, we we understand that. We understand what's at stake. Um, we can't take possessions for granted. So uh, playing our hardest with however many snaps we're given for that game, um, that's crucial and that's vital for us. Uh, I would say our game plan is going to be our game plan. Um, uh, you get 60 to 70 snaps to 40 to 20. I mean, our game plan is going to be the exact same. Uh, Coach Call ha ha has a scheme going, and we're getting it. We're getting it practiced up right now. So, uh, like I said, I mean, like you never know what the situation may be. It could go into triple, quadruple overtime. Uh, you can't count snaps, so you know Coach Hall is going to call the game. He calls, and as players, we're going to try to execute it. I would say losing is enough pressure for us. I mean, a loss is, is pressure in my mind. So, uh, like I said before, possessions or, or, or how many plays you run, I mean, I can't gauge that. I can't, I can't see that in the future. So, in my mindset, a loss is, is, is the defining moment for us. I don't want to lose. And I know my teammates don't want to lose. So, um, if we get five snaps, so this is often going to play five snaps to the best of our ability. Uh, you know, you know for sure. I, I can say um, I'm probably 
uh, top three to four oldest on the team now. Um, and and, and like, like it's been mentioned before, we, we do have a young team and we do have a young offense. Um, even me, as far as playing experience, um, I'm playing experience wise, I'm pretty young myself. Um, but as a leader on this team, you know, I have to take the, the initiative to, to uh, make sure everybody's prepared ahead of time. You know, once, once we get out there in uh, New York, I mean, it, either you're ready or you're not, you know, and, and, and what my job is as a leader for the most part is to make sure I'm ready first and uh, help everybody else get ready too. Uh, I can just say I watch film on Army, so can't can't show my hand too much. But I, I definitely have been watching film on Army, and uh, I know they've been watching film on us as well. So it should be a pretty good game. The, the, sorry, the, the efficiency in the passing game you guys have shown. You can hit the home run ball, obviously, but you feel like they'll have to get better at being more efficient and putting together more methodical drives at all. Is that a concern? Most definitely. Um, you know, short intermediate passes. I can put that on myself and say. Uh, I've been working on that a, a good bit in practice, and I and I've took the initiative to to really hone down on it and, and, and get you know the intermediate passes. And, you know, and no no game can just be shots. You know, uh, uh, it can be tough when you when you go run run the shots. And you know, as a quarterback, I'm trying to help Coach Hall out with being comfortable with having him call anything, and, and I should be able to, to to get the play ran. So um, you know, as offense, like I said, we're we're going to run our game, shots, uh, short runs, whatever it takes. Uh, we're going to get a win. Uh, I can say definitely my, my mindset has been since I was um, probably about six to seven years old when I, when I first started playing tackle football. Uh, I told my mom I wanted to quit. And uh, she, you know, she asked, she said, why you want to quit? You're the best player on the team. And I was like, I mean, I don't have no help. And she was like, that's just, that's just part of the game. You, you got to roll with it, but you can't quit. So uh, my mindset has always been, uh, you know, I, I'd much rather not lose than to win. Uh, so I, I, work, I work how hard I work to um, – to pretty much not lose. That's my. I'm afraid of losing. I don't like losing. I don't like the feel of losing. So my work ethic goes to not losing instead of winning. Um, like I said, my teammates they're prepared. They work hard every single day. Uh, you can see us sweating. We got a puddle right up under me. Um, we're not gonna stop grinding. We're not gonna stop working. So uh, this offense is taking steps every day. The, as far as my senior year? As far as, yeah, this is it. You, know, you, you would think. I don't, college, college part. I don't think of a day I, I, I don't think about my future in football. I can say that. Um, it's times I can't sleep at night thinking about this. Uh, I, I know what this means to, to me and my family. I know what this means to um, my coaches as well. I know what this can do for careers, and I know what this can do for lives. And uh, I do take this personal, and I take this very personal. I can say that. And, you know, this – this this is a business, you know. So uh, if Coach Hall can trust me enough to have me starting on, on his offense, and and he believes me, and his family believes in me to make plays and do what I have to do, that's that's exactly what I plan to do. Anything else? All right. Thank you, Justin. Yeah, I wasn't joking today, huh? <laughs>